Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop the intro. I've got something important to say. Now, as a quiz master, I'm allowed to make one mistake every year, and it happened last week. I accidentally uploaded the wrong episode. So last week's episode was the same as the week before. Some of you noticed this and let us know. First two to let us know were Ian Schultz and Donna Court. You got in touch straight away to let us know of our mistake. And for that, I'm going to send you a quiz coconut pen. Email us back with your address and we'll make sure that gets to you. Anyway, let's get on with today's episode. Roll the drums. Hello and welcome to Quiz Coconut's Quick Fire Quiz Pod with me, James Cutler. Seven years ago, I launched Quiz Coconut and we've since hosted over 2,000 pub quiz nights. Each episode, I pick 10 of our best questions so you can improve your general knowledge, boost your brain power and learn some useful and useless facts. Answers will be revealed at the end of the episode and there's one rule, don't use Google Use your coconut. Welcome back to the quiz pod. It needs no introduction, aside from the introduction that is just had. So let's get into it. Here we go. Ten questions. Question one. True or false? Even though people like Kim Kardashian have tried and failed, the internet has in fact broken before. True or false? Number two, a question about the Spice Girls. Which Spice Girl was the first to have both a baby and a solo number one single? Number three, what word, which means things of little importance, comes from the Latin for three ways? Number four. Which sport did Forbes magazine judge as the world's healthiest? And in fact, it's not even in the Olympics. Number five, music now, folks. You are going to hear two songs. All you have to do is tell me what the songs are. I'll give you a point for the name of the song and a point for the artist who made the song. You're not going to hear the actual songs, though. You are going to hear them in the new craze called Bardcore, where pop songs are played on medieval instruments. Here's song one. And here is song two. Hit the rewind button to hear those again. Number six is one for the boozers. I know we've got some listening. Which is the largest wine producing region in France? Trivia that is hotter than a vindaloo in the Sahara Desert. You are listening to Quiz Coconut's Quick Fire Quiz Pod. Number seven, I want you to name types of clouds. Name one for a point. If you can name three types of clouds, I'll give you two points. If you can name five types of clouds, I'll give you three points. Press pause if you need more time. Number eight, what creature is Baloo in the Jungle Book? Number nine, geography. Which is the world's northernmost capital city? And number 10 is an anagram question. Which is the only word that you can make using all of the letters in Euro Princess? So Euro, uh, E-U-R-O, and then Princess, P-R-I-N-C-E-S-S. Jumble the letters up, there is only one word.
You might need a bit of time for this one, folks, so press pause on the pod and press play when you're ready for today's bad joke. This is today's bad joke. I went to my doctor and I said, Doctor, I'm addicted to Twitter. She said, Sorry, I don't follow you. That was today's bad joke. I think those jokes are definitely getting worse. Here we go with the answers, folks. Number one. Kim Kardashian couldn't break the internet, and in fact, it's never broken since going live. uh, It's never gone down. Number two. Mel B, a.k.a. Scary Spice, was the first to have both a number one single with I Want You Back in 1998 and a baby in 1999, Phoenix G. Number three, which word, which means things of little importance, comes from the Latin for three ways? It's trivia. Now, of course, I think trivia is very important, but that's where the word comes from. Number four, Forbes magazine said squash is the healthiest sport. I thought it was a vegetable. Number five, the two songs here. The first, of course, was Running Up That Hill by Kate Bush, the song that has been everywhere recently. And the other song was Hips Don't Lie by Shakira, featuring Wyclef. I'll give you one point for the artist and one point for the song title, so four points in total. Number six, the largest wine-producing region in France is Paris, because they're always complaining. Of course, I'm only joking. I mean wine as in the drink. Uh, And it's Bordeaux with 900 million bottles every year. Number seven, the types of clouds. There are 10 major cloud types. You might have said cirrus, which are the wispy clouds. Stratus, they're the low-lying clouds. Uh, Cumulus, the puffy clouds. Cumulonimbus, the thunder clouds. Stratocumulus, which are the layered puffy clouds or even lenticular clouds, which are those sort of spinning top-style ones you get at the top of mountains. And other cloud names are a combination of those words. Of course, there's also the eye cloud. Number eight, what creature is blue? He's a bear. Number nine, the world's most northern capital city is Reykjavik in Iceland. And number ten, the anagram of Euro Princess is repercussion. Well done if you got that one. So folks, another quiz pod is over. Don't all cry at once. We'll be back next week. Hit the subscribe button so you don't miss it. If you enjoyed today's quiz, why not book us for your next event? We host corporate events in the UK and Canada and virtual events all over the world. And don't forget to subscribe to the quiz pod so you never miss an episode. We'll see you next week. Quiz Coconut. Nuts about trivia.